Hi, how are you today? In this lesson, we are going to talk about the current system and how to drive plants without even using your mouse. I know that the coordinate system is a bit hard for some of you, but I will try to explain it in the easiest way possible. I will show you a picture that I am pretty sure you have seen in the math class. As you can see, this is a coordinate system with numbers. Below is the X axis and U axis on the top with number in between. If we want to find a point on the coordinate system, write the number first on the X axis, then on the U axis. For example, to find the point with coordinates 2 and 5, we search the number 2 on the X axis and the number 5 of the U axis and it looks like we found the first point. Then on the right of that point we want to drive a line that has light of 3 units and stay on the same 5 units level on the U axis. So from the point we drag a line that is 3 units to the right and we are guided by the X axis like this. First we define the starting point then from then from there we drive a 3 units long line. It is easy to figure out, you just need some time to get used to it. Then you driving will get faster and easier. Surely you have heard about someone that for 15 and 20 minutes create a, few, a who house plan and doesn't even use the mouse at all. You might think this is, is more difficult and more time consuming, but in reality it is not and everyone can achieve this. So let's start now. First we have X axis, U axis and here in the middle you have a square that is Z axis and this one is used when you work in 3D. Ok, first when you drive the line coordinate you need to write the point scene or hashtag, whatever you want to call it, which mean absolute value. Then write the X coordinates, place a comma and write the coordinates for U axis and press enter. It's better to start with 0, 0 coordinates and don't forget that in model space each number included a 1 unit. Let's drive a square that has dimension 10 and 5. First the starting point will be 0, 0. Then we want to line to go up 10 units. So we write the coordinates for X axis which is 0 and then write the U coordinates 10 and press enter. Now what we want to do is the line is on the line on the right to be 5 units so we write 5 to the, to the X axis and 10 for U axis. You might ask why 10? Because in order to ease the driving AutoCAD, every last point is considered with 0, 0 coordinates. So in our case, we want to line to be 5 units to the right, write the first number for X axis, then 10 for the U axis. I know it is a bit confusing, but when you learn, you will drive faster. Ok, let's continue. Now we want our line to go 10 units down, write 5, 0, then to close write 0, 0 and we have our square drive without even using our mouse just by driving but just but writing comments which is interesting because it's last time consuming. Now let's check if everything is correct and as you can see it is accurate to the millimeter. You can use this with every driving tool. And in the end, let's repeat once again. Choose the tool you want to drive with. Choose the starting point, then write the needed coordinate for the X axis, then for U axis. And every finishing point AutoCAD considered to be zero, zero coordinate. And that is that. In the next video, I will show you how to drive using the angle. Subscribe if you want to follow this course so you don't miss out on video. Also follow me in, on Twitter and Facebook and check out my blog for more tutorials and tips and tricks. Links in the description.